What's up, YouTube? It's your girl. I am Kay. Y'all, that pretty little chuckle about it. Everybody want a pizza? Okay. 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 So today, I'm sorry that the chair looks a little retarded, but we're back with another video. As you can see. <laughs> so, basically, this is going to be a story time. And this story time is going to be about, you know, back in the summer. You know, I didn't tell this story because at the time I wasn't thinking about it. You know, I wasn't. I was like, okay, whatever. I was so busy talking about this dude. Da, 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 da. So, we're going to talk about the time I was in the mall with my cousin's girlfriend. And these niggas was following us. Let me tell you something, baby. If you don't have the courage to come to me the first time when you see me, don't follow me around because I'm going to act like I don't see you. Okay, baby? So, let's get this started. Okay. So, basically, you know, we we had walked in the... Because the way... Because this was in, when I was in Maryland. So, basically, I forgot what mall we went to. Uh, but we had went to... Well, the, we had went in one of the entrances. But in, in one of the entrances is a store that we went through. Okay, we looked through there for a couple minutes, you know. We was like, oh, we might come back if we find something we like. So, then we went out of that store, right? And I think it was Forever 21. I forgot what store it was. I forgot, but I forgot what store it was. But I think it was Forever 21. So, when we went in there, we was looking around, you know, just looking at these cute little things, you know. woop dee woop dee woo So, tell me why. When we walk out there, it's two dudes standing right out there by the entrance. I I, can, I seen them. They scared the shit out of me on the low low. They scared the mess out of me. Because I'm like, that. because I didn't expect them. Not to be funny, but I, you know, I didn't expect them to be standing right there by the entrance. So when we walk out, they standing right there. And it kind of scared me. So I, but I was, okay, I, I just, I, you know, whatever. I went on. We walked to another store. So, you know, you know how you always get that sense that somebody, you know, was that somebody's following you or watching, you know, looking at you? I got that sense, but I was like, we in a mall, so, of course, people going to be looking at, you know, looking at it. Sorry, my butt looks a little lopsided. So, then that's when um, we had went into, uh, we had went to another store, right? And so, in the midst of us going in the store, I seen them, right? I, I, like, I saw them. Like, I don't know if they know I saw them or what the case was, but I saw them, right? So, I'm trying to act like I ain't see them. Because it's like, okay, because there have been plenty of times when I've been in the mall and I went in the store, saw somebody, then went in another store, then saw them again. It sometimes it just happens, you know? Sometimes they might like, you know, saying shit you like, you know, you, sometimes it just happens. So, as you know, we, you know, in the store looking around, I, you know, like I just, I keep seeing them because they keep, they was, they was walking back, back and forth past the door. So I'm like, okay, maybe I'm just tripping, you know, like, I don't know. So, okay, I'm like, okay, maybe it's a coincidence, whatever. So, then we went to the, another store, looking around, and tell me why I saw them again. Tell me why I saw these niggas again. Like, and then in my head, it clicked. I was like, okay, now nah, I know it's not a coincidence. I said, ain't no way. I said, first of all, because all these stores that they follow me around are girl stores. So, unless they got a girlfriend that ain't with them right now, they following me. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to just act like I don't see them. Then I seen them. The boy that was trying to talk to me, well, was trying to talk to me, he walked in first, then walked back down, right? I'm like, okay, maybe I'm tripping. Maybe, 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 maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm tripping, right? I wasn't tripping. Because tell me why. Tell me why this mofo and his friends walked back in the store, Right? And then I'm just standing because my cousin girlfriend, she was in the back. She was in the back trying on clothes. You know, but I tried to act like I didn't see the niggas. Like it wasn't, I was trying to act like it wasn't bothering, but it was because I'm like, y'all following me. 
You know, and I'm trying to give y'all the, you know, the decency of not saying nothing to y'all. Because I can get real, I can get real feisty. But I'm trying to give y'all the decency to walk the, f to walk back out that door. And now, like, y'all ain't see me. So they start walking around, like, looking, looking for stuff. So I'm like, I'm like, okay. Then I see them. Let me tell y'all what I seen. I see them walking towards where I'm at. Oh, baby. Baby. No, no, no. So, and then, because the girl, she noticed that they was watching me. But, you know, and then she walked back there kind of where I was. And so she, so what happened was they was walking back towards where I was. And so, I tried to act like I can't see them. I was, I was trying to, like, walk my ass back there where my cousin girlfriend was by the dressing room. Because I'm like, maybe if I walk away, they would get it. They would get that I'm not trying to talk to them. It didn't work because I I didn't I wasn't trying on nothing so I didn't go back there so I stopped like by the like the entrance by the um dressing room and it was a table right there so I sat there so I was on my phone like this right like imagine like this is the table this is how I was sitting I was like this and I see them on my peripheral so I'm like okay I was like please don't say nothing please don't say nothing please don't say nothing please don't say nothing I was like please just you know don't say nothing I was like please don't say nothing to me. And so they walk up, right? And it, it was so funny because I'm like, I was, I was trying to ignore them, but I couldn't because homeboy was standing a little too close. He was right here by the table, like, like you can't see it. Like he was this close, like he was this table. He was this close to the table. So, and I was sitting like right there on the table. So I was just like, okay, I'm gonna be nice. So I was like, he was like, he's like, hey, what's up? You're cute. I was like, oh, thank you. I was like, thank you. And he was like, what's your name? See, I'm being, I see, I don't know why I'm like, like nice. I, I don't, let me tell you something. Don't get me being nice with being, don't get it mixed up with me being nice, being friendly. I'm, I'm not friendly, baby. I'm far from friendly. I'm just a really nice person. I don't go out attacking niggas. Like I, do, I do got a boyfriend, but I'm not the type of person to be like, oh, nigga, bye. I don't. I, 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 I'm not friendly. I'm not friendly. I'm just a nice person. Sometimes a female being nice can get mixed up with her being friendly, and I'm far from fucking friendly, baby. I'm not that type of female. So he's like, what's your name? I was like, I was like, at first I was like, I was contemplating. I was like, mmm. And then I thought about it. I was like, I'm never going to see you again. So it don't matter if I tell you my name or not. Because I don't live in Maryland. So if I tell you my name, it's not going to matter. Because we're never going to see each other again, baby. Uh, So then that's when he had, uh, he was like, oh, I told him my name. And da, 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 da. I really wasn't listening. But, you know, he was like, um, you cute, you know, what's your number? And so I put in my number, right? I'm like, oh, I'm never going to see you again. I don't know why I do that because I wind up always blocking the people. Like, they text me, then I always wind up blocking them. I don't know why I get in my number when I do that anyway. Mm. So I gave him my number, right? So we still in the mall. I don't know if they left or not, but, you know, I don't know if they left. Oh, wait, no, they didn't because I think we seen them again. When we was walking, walking out. So, tell me why, when I gave him my number, they was, they was, the little boy, the boy was so giddy. Like, he was so happy. I was like, Ugh. Like, I don't know. It just, it just wasn't, it was, that, it was like, uh -uh. He wasn't ugly, ugly, but he wasn't cute either. So, you know, that's what that was. So then that's when they walked out the store. And then the the girl who was like watching us, she was like, she like, you shouldn't have gave your number to him. I was like, well, I was like, well, what's wrong with him? <laughs> like, I don't know what they, I was like, what's wrong with him? She was like, he just weird. He just looks weird. I was like, I know. I was like, I shouldn't have done that. And that's when, when me and the girl talking, that's when my cousin, my girlfriend walked out. She was like, what happened? I was like, the, the little boy came up to me asking for my number and I gave it to him. She was like, she was like, Kayla. <laughs> It was so funny. She was like, she was like, um, she said when he texts you, just block him. I do that anyway. So her telling me that just didn't change the fact that I was gonna do it. I did it anyway. Like she was like when he caught when he texts you, just block him. And I did exactly that. I did exactly that. Like as soon as homeboy texts me, I blocked his number out. I blocked his number. 
Because it was just like, you know, it was just weird to me. Because it's like, you were following me around. You followed me to two stores. Two, two stores. You followed me to two stores. Just to get my number. Just to get blocked. Not know you didn't know you was going to get blocked. But baby, come on out. I don't live here. So that's why I went, like, when I'm in Maryland, it's not like I'm being a hoe. When I'm in Maryland, I'm I'm very, I really don't really go out like that. Because I don't know nobody, no nobody really in Maryland except for my family there. And the people that they introduced me to. So that's really, that's really the fuck it. Um, so, but, you know, I feel like I want to do a second story time. And, and I'm just feeling happy. You know, so I'm going to do a second. This I'm not going to do a second video. Am I gonna do a second video? Or I'm gonna do a two in one, two in one story time. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. And we're gonna do a two in one story time. We're gonna do a two in one story time. Okay, so let's do another one. Let's find, okay. So, me and my cousin, right? We in Dave and Busters. We were still in Maryland, we was in Dave and Busters. So, you know, we want, you know, when you and Dave and Busters, when it's just you and somebody else or a whole bunch of females with no niggas around, it's going to be a group of niggas that try to talk to you, right? So, you know, we walking around playing games. And I noticed these, you know, niggas. But, you know, there's other cute, like, other cuter groups. Well, there wasn't no really other cuter group because every, everybody was with a, with girls or something. So, I just knew. I was like, I'm really not even here to, like, try to get no niggas. I was like, I'm really here just to have fun with my cousin. You know, laugh, chill, giggle, talk about things. You know, so I'm like, okay. So, when we, we, I forgot what game we was at. And so, when we walk in, oh, no, I think we came from getting tickets. Cause we had, I bought, we had, I think we had bought something. I forgot what else we had bought. We had bought, I think some put, oh, put money on our cars. That's what we did. And so as we walking back, tell me why these niggas roll up on us. These niggas roll up on us, right? So I'm like, okay, okay. Not, not one of, like, let me say this. Y'all know how that's like two or one nigga out of the group. That's cute. That one was the case. It was like four, five of them. And one was cute. And then this and then there was another one that was semi cute. The other three of them were ugly. The other three of them were ugly. I like I just I was like, mm mm, baby. Mm mm. Baby, baby boy. No. <laughs> no. They they I was just like but they all look like they was like 14, 15, 16. You know, I don't really like they people my age because they be childish. I mean, some grown men childish too. Some like 18, 19 year olds childish too. But a lot of them are mature. You just got to pick out which ones are childish, which ones are mature. So... You know, my cousin, she gave them, she gave homeboy her number first. That was the cute one she gave. She gave the cute one her number. See, but my cousin, she's a year or so much older than me. So, it was just like, eh. When she gave him his number, I was like, mm. I would, cause they, they look like, like, you know how somebody look like they young. They like how people think, people think I'm younger than what I really am. Honestly, people really think I'm younger than what I am. And it is it's not my hair because you know a lot of people older like they twenty be wearing puff balls. But people be thinking I'm like twelve, thirteen, and it's like, baby, no baby. No, what? Like no baby, I'm not even in that range. So he so homie she gave her his number first. And <laughs> it was so funny because when she found out they age she was she was confused. <laughs> she, she didn't know what to do because at the time I, I was I wasn't really talking talking to somebody, but I was talking to this boy that I used to go to school with, and he was and he's one year old. He's one year younger than me, so I didn't have a problem. I don't have a like he, but like see, he's kind of mature for his age, so I didn't really have a problem in talking to him, you know. Uh, so when she found out that age, she was like, uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm doing all that. 
But she was like, oh, she, she was kind of confused. And she was like, I don't know if I should talk to him or not. And I was like, girl, I was like, sometimes um, people who are younger than you be more mature than the people who's older than you. I was like, so girl, you might want to get that. But I ain't going to cap. They all look dusty. Like, I had I have my looking dusty moments. I ain't going to cap. But they, <laughs> like, they just, they just don't look right. They just, it, it was the only, the only two cute ones out of the group. They looked, they looked I. It, But the other three, <laughs> they didn't look right. So, you know, then I gave the other boy, the other, the semi-cute one, my number. And, you know, we, uh, me and her was like, oh, okay. Girl, t tell me why. Wherever we went, we I mean they've been they've been busting in Maryland really not that big, but it's big enough to where you won't see somebody three or four times, you know. That's what happened. And like then we saw them like the last time we saw them we they was at they was shooting, you know, they was doing playing basketball. I felt so sad. <laughs> Cause I'm like, this is embarrassing. I was like, I was like, why? I was like, why everywhere we go, we see them. See, it's just like the mom situation. I was just, I was, just, I mean, and I, think, I don't feel like they was like, like stalking us, but it was just weird because I'm like, we just got y'all. Know. Like we was, I mean, we wasn't in the middle of David Buster's, but we was damn near in the middle of David Buster's. David Buster. So I'm like, like, like we just gave out, we just gave y'all our numbers, and now we keep seeing y'all. See, it was weird because it's like. We gave y'all y'all we gave y'all our numbers, but we're not hanging together. Like usually people who give, you know, each other their numbers, they start walking around, chilling, talking to get to know each other. That wasn't even the case. We went our separate ways. But it was weird because we kept bumping into each other. So it's like I don't know if it was like some way, shape, or form of fate like y'all just gave each other y'all numbers, y'all need to talk. But see to me, to me it was like I'm never gonna see any of y'all, like my cousin too, we both was like, we never gonna see any of y'all niggas ever again. So, basically, us giving y'all our numbers was a waste of time. You know? And then the uh, homie I gave my number to had an Android. So it was like, I definitely know I ain't never gonna see it. And it, it I don't have a problem with talking to somebody who got an Android. I don't have a problem with it. But it's like, I don't live in Maryland. We can't FaceTime. And you can't make no trips down here. So, what was the tea? Like, that was a waste of time. I felt sad. I felt like I wasted my time. And, you know, it got to the point where I didn't block him, but it got to the point where I just, I just stopped texting him. And I deleted his thing, so. So, yeah. Oops. So yeah, I have. To, I think I have the. When I'm in Maryland, I think I have the worst luck ever. Cause it's like there's some cute boys in Maryland, but it seems like they either have girlfriends or some things like like they cuckoo or like like I don't do what I was about to do, but they a little you know, not you know I don't know man. <laughs> but yeah so look Maryland when I come back down there if you live in Maryland if I come back down there hit my line I need some friends to be honest I'm tired of hanging with my cousin and her friends I need some friends of my own baby so you know if you in Maryland hit my line don't hit my line trying to flirt hit my line cause we need to hang out we need to get some, some going you feel me? You know, so that's the end of this story time, y'all. I know mine should be looking busy. I know I be looking broke down because, you know, everybody be getting these, like, they be getting these ring lights. I'm trying to get me a ring light soon, but they really expensive. And I end up bitch trying to get a car before a ring light. So, you know, that's where I'm, I'm at. Uh, You know, so that's what that is. And you know, I know, uh, you know, I'm, I just feel sad. <laughs> You know, but you know, 
one day your girl gonna get up there one day you you know your girl you're gonna be seeing your girl on tv you know you know you know acting or singing god sorry y'all acting or singing so get that chip get a chip girl you feel me though hey you know and that's the end of this oh wait let me do my outro Tell your mama, tell your dad, tell your auntie, tell your uncle, tell your great great uncle, tell your great great auntie, tell your grandma, tell your grandfather about I M K R, and that's the end of this video. Hey.